Hey everybody, welcome to another Dark and Light video. Today, we're going to be continuing and I've leveled up a bit. So, we've got some new items to play with in this chest right here. And of course, we're going to be doing some other things like taming, which I'm really excited about. But real quick, let's kind of go through a little bit. So, I am level 49 right now. I forgot what I was last episode, but I was at least like 3 or 4 levels down. And I've got some new knowledge things. I think... We're actually starting to finish up a lot of them, which is really exciting. Like, I finished up Survival. We're not done with uh, Melee. We're pretty far into ranged. Like, we're pretty far into a lot of these. And even I got the Celestial Staff, which we will see here in a minute. But let's kind of take a look. So, a couple of things. I'm pretty sure I unlocked this, like, maybe two episodes ago. But we have a Fireball, too, which, which is just pretty much Fireball, but a bit stronger. So, that's nothing too new about that. But... Lightning. I haven't ever played with the lightning. I don't know why I never did anything with it, but let's kind of see what it is. Uh, oh, so is it like... Let's go try to kill something. Like I don't know how this works. Does it just hit like anything nearby? Man, is there a creature anywhere around? Man, how... There's always creatures in front of my house. All of a sudden, now I want to test something. There's not a single creature. You know what? That's fine, though. Maybe we could try it on something else. Okay, here's... What, what are these? Bramble hoppers? Yeah, bramble hoppers. Let's see how this works. Oh, okay. So let's just zip what he's after them. All right, cool. Well, I think I'm going to stick to fireball because it looks like fireball has a longer range. So the lightning might be a, might be a bit stronger, but... I'm definitely just gonna stick to fireball. You know what? I'll just leave these in here because I don't really need them right right now. So we've got a Christmas tree, which uh yeah, it maybe I should show you guys what it's made out of. This one wasn't too hard to build. It did have some like weirder materials. Oh, it was in the magic, right? Um maybe it wasn't in the magic. Where is it? Oh, here it is. So yeah, it took the 50 of the rare wood. Some, some weird grass. So it wasn't too expensive. But let's, of course, let's place it down. Now, when I'm recording this, it is the 27th. So Christmas is over. But you know what? You can never be too late for Christmas. I I mean, I guess. But let's place it up in the upstairs. Because, I mean, I, I that's why I built the upstairs, right? There's no reason to build it downstairs. I guess we could place it right in the middle. Why not? Let's just place it right here. Bam. A nice holiday tree. All right, let's see. What else do we got in the wonderful box? We've got haste, so we can try out a couple of these spells, these two. I haven't played with, like, I don't know why. I've never played with this stuff because I've really never had a reason to. So haste, I'm pretty sure if we use it. So we used it. Pretty sure you just go fast, like Sonic. And that is pretty fast. Like, that is a decent speed right there. Now, what does this one do? What does this one actually do? Does it legitimately make... Oh, that makes a map in front of you. And it tells you where you are. Okay, that's pretty cool. I mean, maybe if it was, like, darker, I could see better. But right now, this is way too bright for me to see. I don't even know if it, it'll show up on my recording. But, um... Okay, that's kind of cool. Once again, I've never really played with those two. You know, we could use another speed boost right here. To get to the house quicker. Wham. Run, 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 run. We can get here very, very quickly. Oh, that's a little bit too fast. Okay, so then we got the Celestial Staff, which will pretty much just replace our Druidic Staff. Then we've got a Parachute, Hang Glider, and Large Chest. So I did end up unlocking the Large Chest, which is really, really cool. You might be wondering, yeah, I don't know why, but uh, it won't let me jump from there to there. So I basically just have to kind of climb up and over, but you know what? That doesn't bother me. We also unlocked these Large Chests. So they're basically the Medium Chests, but even bigger now. So, this gives us a little bit more room, and I'm not going to bother replacing the ones downstairs because they're actually fine. What I'll do is, if my chest downstairs get too filled, I'll just come up here, and this will be like access storage. And I'll actually show you, I'm already using this. So, what I did, you might be noticing that I have my uh, Estelle Guard Cloth armor on, which comes from the elves. So I didn't realize this, but I always looked at the NPCs as like super strong things that I couldn't kill. But actually, I could kill them quite easily. Now, they'd kill me back, but I would be able to kill them. 
And uh, this might be like really bad, but I kind of like murdered a bunch of them and stole all their armor. But hey, now we have a lot of free armor here, which I'm planning to go kind of farm their armor uh, a little bit more. Than, I mean, I know it's like totally cruel killing your own people, but you know what? The armor is armor. Instead of crafting it, and this is decent armor, like it has 60 armor, right? Most of the iron stuff, which we haven't unlocked, is 60. So this is basically the best we could get at the moment. So why not? So let's see. We have two things. We have the parachute and the hangar glider. Yeah. So let's put them... I guess. Let's take these off. Put the hang glider there. Now we obviously have to get some more... So what better place to parachute or hang glide off of than the top of your own town. Now, I could probably get up there with, like, a wyvern, but you know what? I, I think this is good enough. If we fall from this, we die either way. So, I'm guessing we just jump and press the button, right? So, I gotta make sure I have the right button. So, let's... Yeah, I'll just, you know, I'll just hold on. So, let's jump, and then... Oh, and then a parachute just goes down. So, that's... Yeah. I guess it does exactly what it's meant to do. It saves your life. Now, let's try the hang glider. Can I jump from here? No. Actually, I'm going to go up higher. Because, yeah, I don't want it to be really lame. I want to... Because the hang glider is a little bit different. So, the parachute you just saw, it basically... You still go straight down. You just don't take fall damage. But the hang glider is a lot cooler. Uh, uh, spoiler, I kind of already played with it just because I was too excited. But, it is a little bit different. Now, the only thing I don't like is they're non-reusable. They're one time, that's it. And that take, and this thing takes like 150 hide and 75 fur. That's that's not cheap. You might, I mean, sure. I could probably pick that up in a minute or two. But um, one time using that every minute or two, I don't know. I, th I think that adds up a little bit. But let's go ahead and jump. And then bam. So yeah, with this, you, you could glide quite a bit. Now, I don't exactly know how to drive it. And it's fairly slow like i oh okay so shift makes it go a little bit faster but like i don't specifically know how to go down it's pretty much just gliding but this this is kind of cool this is technically the first time we've been in the air without assistance from an animal so we can technically fly now there is another option which we haven't gotten to yet but shape shifting if you unlock shape shifting far enough you can actually get into shape shifting into a wyvern which is basically turning yourself into one flying somewhere and then getting off which i'm planning to do i basically wyverns are going to be obsolete once i get the shape shifting ship shape shifting for that now of course it's not going to be completely obsolete because it still takes time to farm but look at that we can just even land in our little territory right here and bam there we go and it'll just disappear off our back so, that is pretty much all of the new things that I've been playing with. Now, let's go back down here and place it back in the chest. Also, things that I've kind of done off camera is I've tried out these iron daggers because the best way to get hide from animals is to use those stone daggers. Wait, no, they're called iron, right? No, these are iron. What are they called then? Uh, these things. Okay, they're just throwing knives. But these are basically throwing knives, but metal and last longer. And yeah, they, you do the same thing. You just get hide really well from it. And I went on a little resource spree. So I'm cooking up some copper in this one. Cooking up some iron in this one. And I'm cooking up some mithril copper. Because my mithril is already done actually. Because my mithril is in here. You can see I have 100 bars already. Two. Two. 100, 170. And then I have some, of course, some iron and some copper in here. Chilling, you know. And we actually, we haven't tried the Celestial Staff, have we? Uh, let me grab a fireball real quick. Actually, I need to have one of those on me. Does it, does this does do anything different? Or does it, oh, okay, it just pretty much shoots. Okay, cool. Well, you guys might be wondering, what are we going to do for the rest of the episode? Since basically I've showed you everything that's happened since last time. Well, as you guys know, we have a good assortment of animals tamed. So here, let me let me get in here. We have, of course, our Brundas. We have our Wyvern. We have a Bargesh. We have a Boar. And over there, we have a Sheep, Turkey, and Longhorn. But those are 
fairly basic animals other than the wyvern. So now, these this animal that I'm going to name up next, it scared me for the longest time up until recently because I figured out I could actually beat it, and that's how I've been uh, leveling. But we haven't tamed a death stalker yet. A death stalker or wolf, which I should quickly Google if we can even tame a wolf. But uh, I definitely 100% want to get a death stalker. Now, do I even have? Do I even have its thing? Uh, Griffin, which Griffin is up next. Yeah, I think we have a death stalker, right? Yeah, this is Wavern, Bear, Mastodon. Wait, no, is death stalker here? No, Infernus Dragon, Nidhogg, Frost Dragon. Do we have? Uh, let me quickly make sure we no this is it right here death stalker yes we do have it okay oh wait do we need okay no we don't okay so real quickly i'm gonna get some stuff together okay guys i think i'm ready i've got my troughs i've got uh my hook arrows i've got meat and i've got like um herbivore stuff now obviously our main thing is to capture a death stalker but we have technically not yet tamed uh, spider, colossal flathorn, or an elk yet. So I am gonna be trying to, like, be to get one of at least one of each because I kind of just want one of every animal, even if it's completely useless, kind of like a turkey. I still kind of want it, you know what I mean? So I guess I'll just cut back in once I find one of these that's tameable. Okay, guys, we got a colossal flathorn here. And there doesn't seem to be much danger on, so you know what? Let's quickly grab this before we get like a death stock or anything. So, yep, just and it seems like it's also stuck. Which what we'll do is we'll stick it with a couple arrows and then we'll let it free. So then now let's get our thing out. Let's I'm trying not to kill the thing. Okay, there we go. We're not hitting it, but we're hitting the tree. Okay, come on. Oh, I hit see I hit the stupid thing. Don't. Okay, there we go. Now it should fall asleep. Because it does need to be moving. Did it seriously escape? Oh. Okay, you need to stand still for me. Great. Okay, maybe this wasn't as easy as I, as I thought it would be. Because, man, these things are fast. But I am going to need it for it to slow down. Okay, come on. Don't, don't be difficult. Oh my gosh, my aim is terrible. Don't be difficult with me. Come on. There we go. Stand still. Oh, now it's a... Ooh. Took a little jab at me. Look at you. Alright, when are... Yeah, I was like, when is this thing gonna fall? Alright, we got it down. We got it down. Well, let's hope there's not a bad guy around, but... He takes apples, right? I'm going to actually eat these. Let's see, does he take apples? He does take apples. Okay. Well, I'm sure glad I didn't kill him by accident. Is that... <sighs> that is an earth elemental. Okay, we're going to have to kill that thing. It's very high leveled. It's a very high level elemental. Which sucks, but you know what? We've grown strong, and we have a mighty sword. Oof. Man, that thing hits like a truck. Okay. There we go. Dead. Those things are strong. It it killed me almost half. Well, yeah, that, that thing's pretty pretty disgusting. Alright, well whoop, is that a griffin? Griffins will okay. How you doing, buddy? No, don't don't go towards my elk. Die. Oh Okay. Man, this place. Don't tell me there's another thing. Man, this place is rough out here, man. Everything's trying to kill my flat horn. All right, well, okay, guys. So we have gotten our first colossal flat horn here. So let's go ahead and put on his saddle. Which one is it? It is this one. And let's see. Can he, can he hold all of our things? Wow, okay. So he can't carry that much, which is a bit sad. Now, ugh, now I'm going to have to drop something, which is kind of annoying. Okay, for now, I'm just going to walk him home because, uh, yeah, he can't carry everything. But uh, I'm going to put everything down once we get home, and then we will ride. Okay, guys, you know what we're going to do? We're going to ride him in a second here. 
There's a spider right over there that I could tame. Now, can you... How, how am I not getting to his options? Okay, so I'm going to need him to stay right here. While I go tame the spider over here. Now, I'm hoping it's a higher level. I mean, technically, I'm never going to use it anyway. So, it doesn't exactly matter. Okay, level 6. That's pretty low. But, you know what? Like I said, I don't think I'm ever going to use it. Seriously, this guy's like juking all of my things. Man, this thing is so disgusting, though. Ew. I'm tempted to just kill the thing. Okay, come on. Fall asleep. Is, is this guy going to fall asleep? I don't want to waste too many arrows on him. I mean, he's a spider. You're going to fall asleep, buddy? There you go. Alright, let's go ahead and... I, th I think he eats meat, right? I, I would guess that he eats meat. I mean, it would only make sense. Yeah, that is... Okay, he does eat meat. That's pretty good. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and tame... Okay, guys, while the spider is still taming, one thing that I just kind of suddenly realized is, why are we still using a bedroll? I, like, it keeps breaking and I have to repair it. I don't get why I just don't build a bed already. It doesn't make any sense, but I guess we will build a bed now. But, yeah, I was wondering, I was like, wait a minute. Why don't I have a bed? I'm like level 50 and I don't I'm not even using a bed. So I'm going to go ahead and place that right there and bam. See, right here we will get a good night's sleep and obviously I want to keep my focus up. Like the the bottom right where the brain is, if that thing drains, I'm going to start dying. So I have to keep that up. Don't Where is it? There you are. I was just say Ooh, if this guy gets to either my spider or my flat horn, I'm... All right, everybody, the spider is up. This hideous, disgusting thing. Let's put that on there. Bam, and we could ride a spider. Now, how does it attack? It just does that. Okay, cool. Well, just as you'd expect, it's a spider. Ugh, I don't even want to be on that thing. And the colossal flat horn. It's even more boring than I thought it would be. It's literally just like, yeah, this is it. And it can barely carry anything. So that's kind of dumb. But, um, of course, I'll stick this one with the herbivores. And I will stick the spider, of course, with the... Oh, okay. oh I was like, can it not even get through? Okay, so I'll leave this one right here. And then here. I need you... Okay, he's already on stay, so I'll leave him there. And then where's my where's my spider? And my spider is over here. Let's get you. Can he jump? No. Okay. Obviously, he can't jump. That'd be cool if he could jump. Can he fit through this door? He can fit through that door. Um, let's go hide him in the back here. I don't I don't even want to see this thing, to be honest. So let's enable it to stay. And then this thing is going to stay back here for a long, long time. So cool, we already got our spider and we got our colossal flat horn. All we have next is the elk and the death stalker. And I'm not 100% sure we're even going to get the elk. I don't exactly know what they look like. I, I, maybe I've seen them, maybe I haven't. I've seen colossal flat horns. I, I don't know what an elk looks like though. It's really, really weird that I like I can't remember. But for sure, we're going to get a death stalker. That's something that like the main thing that I wanted to get today. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to go back out, and whichever I find first, we're going to nab it up. Hopefully it doesn't die. Okay, now it's eating. Okay, quickly, we should probably shoot it a bunch. Okay, it's not a very big death stalker, but I guess we don't need it to be big. Okay, got to shoot it as many times as we can. Ooh, see, now, now it's on attack mode. I need it to fall asleep. Okay, please fall asleep. I'll, I'll probably, yeah, I was going to say, I'll probably die here. And I'm just going to have to keep uh, having to run around. Ah, oh, that sucks. I mean, I kind of expected that. But I got to run back very, very quickly. And I have to kind of keep it entertained while those things are still on it. I mean, I know, I don't know if I caught, if I put it in the video, but I actually did try to attempt to get a, a Deathstalker before, 
and it pretty much killed me and when I came back it was asleep so I'm hoping that's the case right now because that's kind of what I need to happen but if not hopefully I have enough time to kind of just pick my stuff up for a second now the real question is where was I oh, okay I was over here now please tell me is it asleep is it asleep it is asleep there we go see just like I said pretty much have to get it asleep and then I can do my business okay so let's quickly put it down and I'm gonna have to keep it asleep from now on if this thing okay okay hello keys okay I don't know, this game I don't know if it's my keyboard or the game but sometimes my keys don't work which is really unsettling but um okay let's place the meat here okay cool so we're gonna wait up for this thing and then I'm gonna sit here and protect it I'm gonna make it fall real quick cuz I don't want it to be on the rock or it can just float like that okay that's fine but I'm gonna sit here and protect it and I'll see you guys in a couple minutes okay guys so I'm here taming the death stalker so I ended up killing a reaper over there and we got something cool we got a waterfly saddle which is another creature we've never actually tamed before but you kind of find them like near the middle like where the planes are and they're really hideous and disgusting so we might get them but probably not at this episode but also I did build kind of like a little structure around the the land is uneven so I kind of had to build it in two stories but yeah I'll just kind of sit here and I won't have to worry about things attacking me because I just built something now but we are not exactly done yet we've got one more thing to place right here and then actually I could probably even like remove this wall because that's not exactly oop this isn't even needed actually let's oh come on press like one millisecond too early uh, right there right there right there right there bam we are impenetrable at least to the best of knowledge and I've got plenty of arrows on me so I'm just going to sit here and make sure this guy doesn't go anywhere. He doesn't lose his constitution. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm killing the guy. What? <gasps> I had the wrong arrows on. I almost just killed him. Oh, I need to be more careful. I'm going to step back and uh, let this guy get his health back. Jeez. Okay, guys, we are super, super close. I think one more feed, basically, which is going to be in the next at least, like, 10, 15. No, oh, there we go, right on time. Bam, we got our first Deathstalker. How sick is that? Now, let's go ahead and give it some meat. It's really low on health because I shot it with arrows a couple times. So, I'm definitely going to keep it in here. Until it regens. But look how fast it's regening already. So it'll be fine. But man am I excited. These things have been scaring the crap out of me. Basically since the beginning of the game. So now that I've got my very own. I'm going to try not to let it die. Because oh by the way. That thing took over an hour to actually tame. Like legitimately. I, I mean I'm not going to show you that an hour of footage. But I've been in my bed just like on reddit and youtube and twitch for the past hour waiting for this thing but it is finally done i'm even i'm gonna actually gonna leave this house here there's basically no reason for me to get rid of it it may be if i can come back here and maybe i could tame something else who knows or i could use this as storage but for now yeah okay it's storage capacity is surprisingly good yeah 450 that's what i am at for this basically what i'm doing that's really good. Okay, this thing's really, really fast. All right, I'm starting to like this. Now, it kind of, I kind of regret a little bit not trying to go for a higher level Death Stalker, but basically, I can just level it up just by killing some things, and that way I can actually choose where its stat points go into. So it actually, in a sense, it's better this way. It'll just take a little bit longer. See, like here, uh. I could probably kill this. Can I kill it? Okay, that thing does a little bit of damage, but I can definitely kill it. Oof. Okay, I'm gonna run away for like one second here. Oh, that is another Death Stalker. Okay, what I'm gonna do is. 
This thing needs to die. Ooh. If I get it killed, like, right away, I'm gonna be mad at myself. Ooh, level 7. Alright, run away. I need to get a little bit of energy here. Man, why is this thing... You know, I'm just gonna run away from it for now. Look, I know I could beat it. I'm not risking killing this thing right when I got it. For now, I'll just be good. Is that thing seriously still following? Alright, well, I guess we're gonna fight it then. But, jeez, man, why is it still... Why are you still following? But I'll definitely beat... I'll definitely beat it. This thing isn't that strong. Bam, dead. But, yeah, I'm liking this. This is definitely... Ooh, why is there two? There's two. That's not good. Here, I'm going to try to bait them into the town. Okay, follow, 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 follow. I'm not going to try to take on two of those, especially without full health. But I will bait them into town. How about that? And hopefully they don't shoot mine by accident. Maybe I can... Ooh, ooh. Ooh, they're gonna kill. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never mind, never mind. Those things could definitely kill me. I am not okay with that. And then... Hopefully they don't shoot mine. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god, they're coming, they're coming. Don't shoot me. Okay, there we go. That's one down. Now I just gotta wait for the other to come around. Okay, it jumped in the water. Uh yeah, I don't How think it's been? I don't think it's gonna be messing with us. Yeah, I guess I'll just what I could do. I'm gonna tell this one Stay there. And how many arrows? Oh, I have plenty of arrows. There we go. Oh what's hello? Where is the thing? Hmm. Oh, is it fighting the fish? Ooh, that's a big death. That's level 41. That's a pretty big death stalker. Well, I'm going to definitely get rid of it because I don't want to... I don't... Hello? <laughs> Hello? Where'd you go? I definitely don't want it coming back to haunt me. So I'm going to go ahead and take care of it. But real question is, where is it going? Pretty sure I can still snipe it. Yeah, it's going to come towards me, but I can just snipe it. Bam. 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 Dead. I killed another Deathstalker. All right. Well, cool. So I'm going to make sure not to let this thing die because this thing took forever to tame. But man, look at this thing. That looks pretty cool. Finally, we can go up to one of these and not be scared of dying to it. So that's pretty cool. All right, all right. Ooh. That is a vicious attack right there. Yeah, these things are fast, too. You know what? Let's go test it out on this thing. Let's see. Ooh, that, that packs a punch. Jeez. How, how quickly does it eat? Okay, it doesn't eat, like, much quickly, m quicker. I definitely need to raise its stamina. Its stamina is quite low. But I got to remember, it is level 7. So that's something that I do have to remember. But I'm definitely going to be sticking this one up in the meat pile. As I, I guess I'd call it that way. Stick it in the meat pile. Can it not get through the door? Are you serious? How did a spider get through the door but not this guy? You've actually got to be kidding me, right? Well, apparently a death stalker cannot get through doors. So that's interesting. Well, can we build? Let's build one of these, right? Cuz I like I said, I'm probably I don't I really don't want this thing to die. So I'll basically put it in here and try to let it be. I might use this up. Can I go without it? Okay, no. I actually need to demo Oh, no way. I don't know. Should I be demolishing everything? Because it might destroy the entire house. I don't I don't want to break that one piece and have the entire house fall into pieces. That would kind of suck. Hmm. 
Okay, so I could break that and not have the <laughs> house into pieces. That's pretty good. I guess we'll just put that one right there. And cool. Let's see. Do we still have some meat in here? Do we still have? Oh, we have plenty of meat in there. Okay, cool. So there is some more teams. We got the spider. We got the death stalker. And we got uh, the colossal flathorn. So I was going to go get the elk. But you know what? Maybe we'll save an elk for a different episode. Maybe we'll use that the same episode that we get. Maybe the waterfly saddle. Uh, or a waterfly, obviously, and then the elk, and then who knows? Maybe we might go for a bear or a wolf because I did Google. You can actually tame wolves, so we might go for one of those. But for now, guys, I think I'm going to end off the episode here. Guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure you like and comment as it supports my channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.